Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video. Today we're finishing up the Prestige Cup with the Gila G or Julia GTAM. All right, so we're going to do the last uh, 11 races. This is the last 0 to 100 race. All right, so that's why we're going to start with this one so you can see how fast you need to do 0 to 100 in. So let's go find out what that time is. All right, here we go. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Second, third, fourth, nitrous. All right, so we did it. We won. We won. So the other guy ran about a 5.2. All right, so you got to do 0 to 100 and about 5.2. That's really not that hard to do on this car. All right, I've only got like two or three stage six parts on this, so it's not that heavily upgraded. I do have all the fusions that can currently hold. Um, I don't think it can hold more fusions until I get more stage six parts. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Second, third, fourth, nitrous. You know what? On the next run, I'm going to see if it uh, runs faster if I shift into fourth as quickly as possible instead of doing it slowly. I can't remember which one actually ran faster, but one or the other. Here we got 11.778. 11778. All right, nice big chunk of RP right there. 11778. I got to remember that, guys. I got to remember that. 11778. My memory's terrible. I'll probably forget before this race ends. All right, here we go. 3 2 1 go. 2 3 4 nitrous. All right, what's faster? What's faster? On a maxed out car, I think you shifted uh, quicker than this. Or I think you shifted quicker like this, but I'm pretty sure when you're not maxed out, you shifted a little slower. 11 point, yeah, that was a little slower. Okay, cool, cool. We don't want to shift it that fast. All right, here comes race number 22. And there's a total of about 30 races on these. Always make sure you do that 31st race, though. Get yourself up on those leaderboards. Even if you don't come in at a high place, at least you get a few keys for it. So a few keys is better than no keys, right? All right, so we have to do 183 miles per hour on the last speed trap. So as long as your car does 0 to 100 in less than 5 seconds and can hit 183 miles per hour, you should be good to go. I'm not sure exactly what the time is on the very last race yet, but we'll find that out in just a minute. All right, let me get a little bit more gold. Let's go back and let's go do it to it, guys. Let's go do it to it and finish this off. Find out what that final time is and figure out what you guys need to run to complete this thing. Hopefully this is going to be one of those easy prestige cups. Just so you know, my upcoming live stream, guys. All right, Max the Gamer will not be on there with me. On Friday, Max has some things he has to do. So I'm probably just going to do like an hour-long live racing live stream that day. Instead of the Q&A type thing. It's just, uh, I don't know, doing that kind of stream on either one of my channels, it's just... It just feels awkward doing it alone. I don't know why. It's so much more fun when I have another person with me. So, three, two, one, go. So, I'm probably not going to do that type of stream unless I have Max on there with me. So, yeah, we'll just do a nice live racing stream just like I do on Sundays. But we'll probably just do it for an hour, maybe two. We'll see how it goes. I'm not sure. We'll see what happens. All right, we got some fusion parts. That's always good. The best thing about these prestige cups is all the RP that you can get. That's why I always tell people, save your keys, guys. Save up those silver keys. Don't waste them. Save up several thousand before you start trying to pull these, these cars with the silver keys. That way, every time a prestige cup car comes up, you're gonna be able to get it easily because there's no guarantees that you're gonna get these things unless you have 750 keys saved up and you could run into one or two or even three seasons in a row where it can take all 750 keys that's not likely but it could happen i've seen two in a row where it did that 
and that's never fun because that's i mean 750 keys times two man that will that will suck up your keys and you'll be broke on the keys in no time so i always say save up at least 2000 guys i got some videos on resource management and stuff probably on my csr2 basics playlist so if you guys are struggling with your game cache and your resources and stuff like that check out those videos of course when you're a brand new player there's, you gotta beat all the Tempest races, you gotta beat Shax, you gotta beat this, beat that, beat the other thing. So resource spending as a new player, it's coming in, it's going out just as fast as you're getting in. Cause that's pretty normal actually. Alright, once you get past like the Tempest races and stuff, you should be able to start saving up your uh, game cash. So don't expect to be able to save until you get through a bunch of that junk. You got legends to deal with now. When I when I started, it was just you know it was just we had the tempest races to get through. Now you guys got legends. You've got all the elite tuner stuff. Oh man, there's there's so much stuff for you guys to do as new players these days, which is actually kind of cool because, I mean, the more stuff to do, the better. It gives you stuff to work towards and you know fun things to do. Sometimes I feel there's almost too much going on though. Sometimes it feels like they've just got way too much going on. All right, let's see what we get here, guys. What race are we on? I'm not sure. I'm busy blabbing instead of paying attention to where we're at. So let's see what happens. All right, here we go. All right, we kicked that Honda Civic's butt. Yeah, we did. All right. Let's see what race we're on. How many more do we got? Ah, we're on 29, so we're almost done. Two more races. Two more races. All right, we got us another stage six part. Hopefully, that's not a duplicate, and hopefully, we won't need to go install it. We'll see if we get stuck or not. I'm not really sure if my car is currently fast enough, but I sure hope that was not a duplicate stage six part. That's one of the things I hate more than anything is when this game gives you a duplicate. Sometimes you'll be like, oh man, I've already got 12 stage six tires for this car. Why did it give me another one? It's like, yeah, I got 12 stage six tires, but I don't have any of the other parts. Sometimes that gets a little bit crazy. All right, guys, next race is gonna be the last one and it's showing extreme. So I'm probably gonna have a hard time. I might actually need to go install that part. So. The good news is we're at least going to do the last race and figure out how fast you guys need to go. Whether I win or lose on this one, it doesn't matter. This will give you an idea of what time your car needs to run. So we had the last speed trap, we had the last sprint race, and now we're doing the final time. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Second, third, fourth, nitrous. Now, sometimes when your car beats dyno by as much as this one does, it doesn't really matter if it says extreme because it's kind of going by your car's dyno. If your car's dyno is like three tenths of a second slower, it's going to say extreme. You're not going to be able to make it. So he ran a 12.1. All right, that was pretty easy. There's always one really slow guy. All right, I don't know if that was the slow guy or not, but I got a big old chunk of RP right there. So that's one of the best things, guys. Prestige Cup, Cup pays out loads of RP. So I think that pretty much wraps this one up. You're probably going to have to run somewhere about 12.0, 12.1-ish. All right, it's always a little bit different for everybody. When you la race the last race, you're probably going to get a different car than I did that runs a slightly different time. So when you get stuck, if you get stuck, you can usually go back, right? You can usually go back to your garage come back to the race, get a car, a different car. Sometimes it might run a little faster. Sometimes it might run a little slower. But if I get stuck, I go back to the garage and come back several times until I actually get a car that I can beat. So we're going to go back and, uh, oh, cool. It was, not, it was not a duplicate, guys. They gave me a stage six that I actually needed, so that's really cool. And, yep, we will catch you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe, hit that little bell, set those notifications to all. Alright, check out my merch store, there should be a tab on my page for my merch store, and if you'd really like to help support the channel, you can become a paid monthly member as well. Alright guys, catch y'all later. Thanks for watching, y'all have a great day, and we will see ya lightning out.